What's up, party people? This your boy, SHOW, and we're here live, episode one, Miami Hurricanes football, maximum football 2019. We coming at y'all all the way from Florida, baby, where them balling boys at, them cane boys, and we gonna get it in against the LSU Tigers, week one of the college dynasty mode. You see, we got the Miami Hurricanes here, man. We going all the way. Now, look, now, let me be serious for a moment. Now, look. I made the logo uh, as best I could, you know, with the local editor. I've never really used it that much, man. So I wanted to give a little uh, a little run. Came out pretty decent. Felt like it might be a little better, but it looks pretty good for the most part. But yeah, man. Uh, yeah. I know y'all was probably wondering where the first episode was at because I told y'all I was coming out. I'm going to ask y'all with the first episode, like, the day it came out. I uploaded the little deep dive into the customization suite. So I'm going to be honest with y'all. I played a game or two, right? And I was just like, man, I can't, I'm not feeling the gameplay. Like, the first day it came out, I played a game or two. I was like, oh, my God. Now, no, I had played last year because I bought it last year on the day it came out. But I just really was not impressed at first with, like, the gameplay difference from from 18 to 19 so i put it down for like a couple of days then i saw that they was doing a content update i was like okay maybe so they'll you know they'll fix some things so i looked at the details and blase blase so i was like okay i'm gonna give it a shot played it 30 times better 30 times better defensive backs react a lot better now the receivers act a lot better now the running is still glitched up you can't really get nowhere as you can see on the screen you know most you might get is 10 yards you might get lucky get a little 15 20 yard but other than that you're not really gonna move the chains too much you gotta stick to the passing game so yeah man this is week one Miami hurricanes i'm coming at y'all man so i've just been getting used to the gameplay and stuff you know uh it's a lot. It's it's a lot to adjust to, you know. Like to me, I feel like that should have been a catch right there, definitely, because he was beat. But due to due to the gameplay mechanics, you know, it bounced off the back of the defender's helmet, and then it just kind of fell to the ground. That's one thing I want them to address in one of the next content up content updates, is so that you know you can be able to you know react with the ball after deflection or what the case may be. Like say if you get a tip. And then you can still try to catch it because I feel like once you touch it one time, the ball's pretty much dead, but it'll still be in the air. They need to definitely patch that. First down Miami Hurricanes, though. Yeah, man, I try to do a lot of little dump routes because those seem to be the most effective ones. Now, no, you can catch them over the top a couple times, but uh, you might as well just stick with the uh, stick with the straight up little dink and dunk game, man. It's going to get you pretty far. But as you can see on this first drive, man, I was doing pretty good. Pretty, pretty well, you know. The computer's a little staunch because, you know, they get all these kind of breakup plays. You can't really get nothing deep for the most part, but you might can catch them over top, though. But as I said before, but, yeah, it's not too much going on here, man. But as you can see, we back here on, on second and ten, yo. Yeah, I was doing pretty good up to this point. Just trying to uh, get some offense going. See, we got a handoff to Lingard here. Number one for the Canes, you know, even though my Canes ain't really doing too good right now in real life, we're going to try to right the wrongs, you know, and make sure that they get their ass in gear because they've been BSing for the last, what, huh, 18 years now? Like right after we lost to Ohio State, it just went kind of down the tube. So we're going to try to right the wrongs right here, man. But definitely, though, we got coming up third and 10, DJ Dallas. You know, I try to get most of the names. I'm probably going to complete the roster soon, but each team I play, I'm going to try to edit them so that it resembles the actual team in real life. So that's why it's LSU. Try to give it a little logo. I'm probably going to make their logo since it's just a little text. Like, it just says LSU pretty much. I'm probably going to make that really quickly. So in future videos, I think the week after this one right here with LSU, I think I'm playing... I'm really not sure. Oh, yeah, I'm playing the uh, Huntington Bass, the Marshall team. So I'll probably do their logo next. As you can see right here, Scheffler, 82, 10, 5, 6 burger. Let's go, the Hurricanes. As you see, I got my first touchdown, first touchdown of, of the game. Let's see if the Hurricanes can keep it up, man. Now, I think I pretty much mastered the kicking game, especially with the field goals and stuff. You know, all you got to do, pull down on that right stick. It'll make the ball go up more like this. And I think it gives it a lot more distance as well, too. And then you got a fast, 
uh, click the L, you know, the uh, the left joystick back and forward. You have to do it in all like one motion. It can't be like a delay or nothing like that. So you got to make sure you do it like that and get it good. So you get a nice little distance, good little length on it, etc. Yeah, I'm I'm learning this game, you know, as I play it more because I probably played maximum football 2018 maybe two times, if that, and then put it down, didn't touch it anymore because I just was fed up. As you can see right here, I think they need to fix this because when I switch to the defender. He stops. I think when you switch to the defender, it should keep running and allow you to keep running with him while it's in stride, not having to stop once you switch to him. Because, I mean, that just completely takes him out the play then versus what you see right there. So, you know, they need to definitely patch that. But, yeah, though, it's, it's, it's pretty good for now, though. You just got to know when to pick and choose your spots and when to play your cover twos and all that and your pass prevents because they will definitely catch you over top with that foolishness, man. But, yeah, though. Be coming into the second quarter. About to get this kickoff going. Man, 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 man. I'm trying to tell you. If they can really, really get this game like up to par as just far as like mechanics working, you know, everything else will come into play. I feel like the visuals are pretty decent for now. As you can see, a six burger right there. Uh man, I try to get over to him fast enough, but you know, a late button delay, late button response. Not, I'm not trying to bash the game at all. Just giving, you know, uh, certain critiques and criticisms just to make sure that, you know, they stay on the top of their stuff and stay on their toes, man. Because we want this game to be excellent for years to come so that people can enjoy it and that it won't be out here getting all the trolls talking about it. Like, oh, my God, the game's trash, bro. Why did you play that crap, man? No, we don't want to hear none of that. We just want you to make sure that you test the game out when they get the game straight. You know, as of right now, they're getting the game straight. And much, much, much respect to Canuck play. As you see, past break up on third and two now it's fourth and two more than likely gonna punt it but i think right here i think i went for it. yeah i definitely went for it yeah you know we gotta definitely go for it because sometimes you know <clears throat> you might not get another chance to score so that's why i pretty much yeah kind of went for everything because yeah you you gonna need all the tips that you can get ah wide open jeff thomas number four Touchdown Hurricanes. Let's go. All day, baby. So, yeah, we see now it's 14-13 going for the field goal. Extra point. One-point conversion. Trying to tell you, man. Get, get your kick in straight. To me, there should be no reason why you should be missing field goals in this game, especially like straight on ones, because it's not really too much factoring into whether or not you miss it. It's pretty much on you. If you just put it on target, you'll do good. First and 10, about to be first half over with, getting ready to go into the second half. Good pass breakup, man. Sometimes the defense reacts really good, and sometimes the D nah, the defense doesn't react at all. But, you know, it's, it's more times than not, though, so we can live with it for now. Ah, wide open, see? Stuff like that. Now, that was my bad on that one because – me looking and trying to scramble to get to the quarterback, I took out to my man out to play by controlling him, which I didn't even realize. So he's wide open for the touchdown. Six man, LSU. Yeah, I'm trying to give y'all some gameplay analysis and give y'all some actual game review at the same time. You know, now that it's been out for about a good week and some change now, so definitely, man. I see people really enjoying it online, though, tweeting about it, sharing all the custom uh, creations and all things of that nature. Things pretty good, man. Only thing, another thing that I wish that we had too was we definitely got to have some color options for this equipment. So, like, that's such a must. Everybody can't have white cleats on, man. Miami don't even wear white cleats. Like, the gloves look like lineman gloves, and they got to deal with Phenom Elite. I don't know why they ain't put them gloves in there yet, them Phenom gloves, because those are pretty sweet. Like I said, they need to put all that equipment stuff in the game and get that all out the way just so they can have it all in there. Definitely need to do that, so they they also need to fix the depth charts too. I mean, I can read the depth charts, but most people can't. So Jeff Thomas gone, 45, 40, 30, 20, 15, 10, touchdown hurricanes. Jeff Thomas, yo, Jeff Thomas gonna be leading leading the league, man, leading the country and receiving yards by the end of the, uh, the week probably because he's going crazy already. That's like what 250 yards, 270 yards, man. Jeff Thomas. About to be 20, 21, 21, 21, tied up. 
Bang! Lou Don. That's an also another funny thing, too. They definitely want to stay away from having any kind of even American sounding names because some of these names in here is like, wow, Lagan, Cap'n, Lou Don. Like, they be having some wild stuff in here, but I get it, though. I'm trying to take care of, you know, cover all your ground so that you ain't getting hit with no stupid lawsuits because, you know, NCAA is petty. Petty, petty. Williams, 35. Uh, that's another thing too, man. They definitely got to patch them ends coming in so fast. I mean, they'll literally be in your backfield in 0.5, yo. You have no time. It's either you're pretty much at the mercy of when they want to come in. It's either they coming in or they not. I went for it right there, got lucky, caught it, and thanks to the game glitching up, I got the first down because that definitely wasn't a first because he was way uh, probably about a good yard in front of the line. But, hey, I'll take it e either way, though. First down, Canes, baby. Let's go. First and 10. Put it out there. Put it on him. Ah. DJ Dallas with the negative two. No yards gained. Two yards lost. Second and 12. Ah. Catch by Thomas. Defender missed it. I thought he was going to get it, man. That's another thing. If this was Madden, that would be a pick. That would be six. And thank God it's not. <laughs> Fling it. Triangle. Oh, he's wide open, though. Either way, man, I'll take it. See? You got to be reading, man. I don't remember throwing it to him when I played it, but, hey, I guess that's what it was. Wait a minute. I do remember, though. I'm being really stupid right now. As you can see, we got the lead, man. Get ready in the fourth. 28 coming up to 21. Hurricanes. Got the lead going in the fourth quarter. Let's see what LSU Tigers can do, man. First and 10 on their 20. Ah! See? And he was out of bounds, too, man. Y'all got to patch that, Maximum. Y'all got to patch that. He was definitely out of bounds, though. But no. You ain't got your stuff right, though. That's another thing y'all got to address, man. But it's all good, though. It's just criticism. Let's not bash. Not bashing. Ah, no good. Hurricanes about to get the W. Conversion, no good, yo. Can the Hurricanes close it out? Let's see. Second and 10. Williams looks poised, drops back. Hits a receiver, Dallas. Okay, Dallas with room. 50, 35, 40. Okay, okay. Looks like the Hurricanes are going to cruise to their first win of the season the, in the home opener. Miami Hurricanes, 28. LSU Tigers, 27. Y'all, it's been real. That was episode one. Stay tuned for episode two. We're going to get into more of the recruiting process. See what players we're looking at, man. See what players we're not looking at. Check the other standings. Check what other teams are doing. And we're going to get ready for the Marshall Thunder and Herd, man. S-H-O-W. Coming at y'all all the way, man. Show Sports Gaming. S-H-O-W. Let's get all the way into it, y'all. Yeah.